So today we're finally going to be starting on the front lip of the car. It's been a long time coming and finally have a PVC sheet that I'm going to put underneath the car, trace over the design that I want. Then we're going to cut it and whatever material is left, I'm going to make uh, side wings for the E46. And I'm also going to make canards. Um, not sure if I'm going to be installing the canards since my bumper is fiberglass. Don't really want to be drilling into it. But we'll see, maybe I can make it so I can just use double-sided tape and hopefully we'll stay like that. But um, the main goal today is just cutting this off and hopefully getting it painted and mounted. So let's get to it. So we marked it about two inches with a box. That way when we're gonna start sliding, it's gonna be nice and even all around. I got the trees blowing in the wind with the clouds blowing over sunny days where you been. No one left to talk to, I but really had a last for you. Let you decide, let me know what you want to do. Whenever call me, walk my ass to class, I bet you leave it so calmly. Tell me how it is, I think you want to at me. Possibly find ways to entertain myself, I still think of you constantly. What you thinking? Floating downs, I bet they kind of sink it. Butterflies or rainy days, can I take my spirit? What you trying to do with all that energy? There's a certain type of mystic in the air when you're next to me, so bright and sunny. Early morning's just my tea and honey. Can call you up, but it won't make you love me. I float it, but to the side, I got it duly noted. And I can really focus, I hope you really notice. See, if I hold it back, I'll end up exploding. And you don't want to see that, I see your life is golden. See, is that here to go? I know you really like my CD. I probably could do it better, but life hasn't been that easy. I know that you really like it. Only get a few more hours so so originally I wanted to make it about four inches wide, which was too big, but I think this is gonna be perfect. No more than that. came out but we cut the lip already it looks good it's exactly where I want it to be um, the side fins do poke out a little bit too much but it's okay because I'm gonna have to cut them straight since I'm doing a little um, triangle design on the side uh, to make it look more sporty but yeah this thing is coming out pretty good so we're gonna do that for the sides and then we're gonna play with the fins in the back so the lip looks awesome but this thing looks even better look at that Damn, once this thing's painted black, oh my god. That's literally what it needed. That looks so aggressive right now. I'm extremely happy with this. Wow. So, this is the old one. As you can see, very small, not that aggressive. And then this thing just looks awesome. Damn, I'm super happy with this right now. I'm gonna spray it black real quick and put it back on. That looks so good. Here's one side painted. I still have to sand it down, make the edges a little bit uh, rounder, sharper on some points, but I am so happy with how that looks like now. Now that's super aggressive, looks really good. Let's see from the front. Oh yeah, that looks great. That looks so much better. Um, so we have the front lip here as well that we're working on. We're going to be painting that black, putting it on the bottom and adding the fins on the side and then messing around with the canards. But so far, super happy with how this is coming out. I should have done this a while ago when it was warmer, but damn, I'm really happy with how this looks right now. I can't wait to paint that black, add the fins, maybe add a little bit of a small lip on the side skirts, and definitely a rear diffuser. This car needs it. Just like the E36, it looks so good with the rear diffuser. Now this car needs it. So definitely super stoked with this. Looks awesome. Uh, it was like, well, this piece of shit actually got expensive. Uh, they used to be like 20 bucks. I think I picked it up for like 38, if I'm not mistaken. Maybe even 28, I don't recall, but definitely good because you get a massive sheet that you can do a front lip, side skirts, um, the fence for your wing, a bunch of stuff you can do with this stuff. So 
Super cool. I might be getting another one and just making a replica of my E36 diffuser because when I mocked it up, it fit. I'm trying to... I don't recall if I took a video of it, but I'm going to try to put a clip or something in here. So we're going to do something similar to that, put it on this, and it's going to look so sick. Definitely really happy to be working the E46. It was definitely in the back burner while we were working on the E36, but now that the car looks semi-decent to drive, we can get back to working on the E46. So super stoked. Uh, definitely going to do a lot more stuff to it. Going to get stiffer springs for my K-Sport coilover so I can go a little bit lower and get bigger um, and get bigger spacers so I can poke the wheel out more because I really want the fitment of this car on that. Like, this is so perfect. It pokes just the perfect amount. The rear is tucking, fender the lip like super flush. The front rubs a little bit, the rear rubs a little bit. That's because these are my max speeding rack coilovers. So they're not as stiff as my case ports, but they're definitely like for $200. Uh, when the video comes out on me reviewing these coilovers, bruh no joke these are actually pretty good but definitely stay tuned for the full video because i'm still driving the car i'm waiting for them to settle all that stuff i had other people drive it and even they like it but definitely stay tuned for that video but that would do it for this video for now um it's getting really cold and it's like raining on and off so i'll wrap it up for today that'll do it for this video in the next video these will be painted sanded already put on and then we're going to be messing around with the front lip some more just to get it dialed in perfectly. So now I painted the front lip. It's not perfect. I just sprayed it black to see how it would look. Because as I mentioned, it's pretty cold out. So kind of done for today. But damn. The new side uh, winglets and the front lip. Definitely making this car look crazy right now. I can't wait to finish uh, the front lip and put it on. And definitely some canards. Now that I'm looking at it. Definitely need something right here and right here to make it a little bit more aggressive. But that looks so sick. I'm super happy with that. Well, there you guys are for this video. I'm not going to put it on today. I'm running out of time. It's freezing right now. So next video, this is probably definitely going to be put on. Um, still trying to figure out how I want to do it. Since the bumper's fiberglass, I think I'm just going to get some uh, metal brackets from Home Depot and bolt them right up to the chassis of the car or at least the front crash bar and have it go all the way down and bolt it up to that so if anything goes wrong the lip gets uh, ripped off not the bumper but hopefully nothing goes wrong and damn i'm seriously super happy with how this thing looks right now definitely gonna have to do like a little fin on the side like a tiny bit maybe like a quarter of an inch uh just because i'm already like catching it with my foot as i get out and adding that on is just gonna be worse but definitely gonna add something for the side so it matches the front and definitely gonna do the rear similar to the E36. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. So I'ma try this. Staying up at night so loud just like the sirens. Hold up. Need to take a little bit of